So guys, welcome back to my channel. If you don't know me, my name is Karande. If you know me, then welcome back. This video, I'll be enhancing my natural features, but to the extreme. So if you want to see that, then continue watching. So for base, we're just going to start off with simple foundation, concealer. That's it. Is the Fit Me Concealer and the Fit Me Foundation. B55 for the foundation and 45 for the concealer. I'm using that on a brush. Crop that the one I'm using this. For concealer, we're gonna apply a lot of concealer. Cause need to cover up those problem areas, you know. So how have you guys been? This is my like I don't know what I'm uploading this video. So I can't. Well, I just posted a video recently. And it was the first one in a long time. But my channel was still jumping, so like I kept getting hundreds of views for some reason. I'm not sure. Now we're gonna do like everybody else and let this dry down for a little bit so we get the fullest coverage that we can get. And I'm actually gonna blend it out with a flat foundation brush because it gets all the way up underneath my eye. All right, that's how much I'm gonna let it dry down because I don't have no patience. I'm gonna do everything but the under eye and then we're gonna sit, like, let the under eye sit while I do everything else, which makes sense. You gotta make that face where I put on concealer, like, to get all the way on you. Just like that. I'm not gonna set my makeup because I think it look better, a little shiny. So I'm not gonna set it. I got the idea from Eve Fraser. Eve S F S R on YouTube. So if that's why the video seems familiar, that's why. Next is contour. So this is like one of the biggest steps because this is gonna change our facial structure a little bit, not too much. I'm using this the rose color from Makeup Revolution. Use this bottom shade, cut the good contour shade for my skin tone. I will see with upward motions, like on the side of my cheek. Now, use the same color to contour your nose. I mean, I should set a little bit. Yeah, I need to set, because that looks shiny. Get my dry beauty blender. Yes, it's dry. And put a little bit of powder. Looks better. Now we're going to use a brush like this to draw it out. And then I'm going to use a fluffier skinny brush to blend it out. Now the point of this is to make your nose look elongated, but also like a button nose. I'm not sure if my nose already like that. My nose is very round, so I'm going to make it look like a button. So first you're gonna go down the sides, and then you're gonna go across the bridge at the bottom, like so the tip looks a little smaller. All right, once you got it all drawn out, it's kind of strong, strong color, but use fluffy brush to blend it out so it won't be looking like this. Once you get the nose contour, it's time to go on to blush. Now she used a peachy blush and a pinker blush, so I won't do the same thing. I'm just put on her eyelids. So, I'm going to my Neutral Steve palette from Makeup Revolution. I'm going to take this bottom shade right here. And then I'm also take this 
here we go this orange shade right here as plus so the pinker shade is gonna go out here now dip to the orange shade a little underneath your eye And pink shade, I'm also going to brush into my eyelids. Acting up. So, you know, healthy now is all like, mm, you want to do this now. At 18 years old, you want to eat healthy now. I'm going to see that orange shade across my nose in the center. Next, I'm gonna take a small flat brush. Take a shimmer shade, it doesn't really matter which one. I'm gonna take this one at the bottom and apply that to my, I don't know what to call it in English, but it's right here. Gives the appearance of bigger eyes. Now, if she did liner, I'm not gonna go on the liner because I lost my, I lost my eyeliner. So no way I could go on the eyeliner. But I'm gonna take this deep purplish brown shade and apply that to the outer corner of the my bottom, the bottom of my eye. So oh, I thought she needed them down there. So your appearance. Um, the eyes like these ones before. That's a little bit of dirt inside my So I'm gonna take a brush, a brush, a brush, and blend it out a little bit. Next, I'm going with some mascara. This is the Wet n Wild Mega Brown mascara. I really like this mascara actually, it costs a dollar. So. You probably can afford it. If you can't, and I mean, I understand, but I've been broke before. Ooh, you got raccoon eyes, but it'll be alright. Highlighter is next. I'm using Over Cosmetics Radio Drive Highlighter. I'm gonna apply that like heavily. So it gives the contour nose more of an effect. I'm also gonna put that in the inner corner of my eye. I'm not gonna do it on my cheeks because we got all this blush. So. Now I'm do something weird. I never tried it before, but we're gonna try it on camera to mess up the whole video then. Just going to the whole video. I'm going to line my lips with powder. Using this top brown shade, it's like reddish brown. I'm going to line my lips. I'm going to overline my lips. I have big lips, but hey, I want to overline. That's the top one. So once you got that, I'm probably this unknown name lip gloss, look like this, and apply it to my lips. You yeah, have fake freckles, lashes, liner, but this is a simplified tutorial. And I think it's effective, because look at me. <laughs> Not in freeze. But if you guys enjoyed this video, give a thumbs up, leave a like, leave a comment, and share if you really want to. And I thank you guys for watching. I'll see you in my next video.